All right, just wanted to do an update on my wheel. I tore it down a little bit. Did a lot of the magnets. There's uh, 16 sets all the way around right now. I'm driving it off of three coils on some big iron transformer steel pieces. They're about an inch thick. Um, basically, the main drive of the motor is the magnets attracted to the steel pieces here. I'll show you the timing here. We'll get this light here, get it over here, and you should be able to see when it fires versus on the coil. Let me see if I can get it in here so you can see it good. This one's about the same, it's a little farther out, I think. So the steel sucks it in pretty good, and then the, basically when I fire the coil, it's ejecting the fucking magnets. Um. <laughs> the center one, here the washer stator, it's basically running through a rectifier here and a capacitor and all that. This is the DC voltage that it's collecting off of the center stator currently for the RPMs that I got going on. And ain't much power coming out the center, but the torque in the center is getting better and better. The more of these coils that I add, you know, the more of these that I add around this wheel, the faster and faster this thing should get. And the more and more powerful it should get because it's sucking the more steel at one time. Currently, it's probably running two and a half, three amps, but that that's working these coils pretty hard like they're 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 taking a lot of this ripping away action going on timing's a little off too so i could expect to get the high amp draw on it right now because nothing's perfect she wobbles right but if you do the math on it half of a four foot wheel be 24 inches you can do the lever formula for if I put one newton pound force out here, how many newton pounds I get out here, and that's all about the RPM. Well, I hope you guys like the update. Comment, share. Thank you.